Hello friends, let us continue our series of uh, tricks on uh, subtracting numbers which involve a carry. That means the unit digit of the first number is less than the new, uh, unit digit of the second number. So we need to carry and students make a lot of errors in these kind of questions. So if we can do this orally uh, without writing the two numbers one below the other then it will save a lot of time of students and uh, those errors which creep in uh, using the traditional approach that can be omitted. So let's see how this is done. I have already told you the method but I will just uh, you know tell you the steps to uh, do that all over again so that students who are watching this for the first time they can see how quickly this can be done. Now see 95 is very close to 100 it is just 5 less than 100 so what you do is increase both the quantities by 5 so that this becomes 100 and if you increase this by 5 this is 148 and now subtracting 148 and 100 is very very easy why because you don't need to write the numbers one below the other the simple answer to the question is 48 so if you subtract 143 and 95 you are going to get the same answer 48 isn't that easy and saves a lot of time of course yes let's see 262 and 146 now see 146 is very close to 150 so if you add 4 to this you get 150 so add 4 to this you get 266 and now subtracting 266 and 150 should be easy because it does not involve any carries so 0 1 and 1 110 is the answer for this question so no carries no worries let's see 481 and 279 i know that this is one more one less than 280 so i'll just make this as 280 and I have increased this by 1, so I have increased this also by 1. And now 482 and 280 subtraction is very easy. It is 220. Okay, 202. Now this is how you need to carry out the subtraction of numbers which involve a carry. So let's see three more examples, say 111 and 47. This is very close to 50, so I will increase this by 3. So this is also to be increased by 3. Now see 11 minus 5 is 6 and we have a 4 here. So 64 is the answer. This is very close to 60. So I have increased this by 1. So let's increase this also by 1. Now 13 minus 6 is 7. So 77 is the answer. Finally we have 194 and 87. This is very close to 90. So I have to increase this by 3. So increase this also by 3. Now 19 minus 9 is 10 and we have a 7 here, so 107 is the answer for this question. So friends, subtraction using uh, this, this method can be very useful for uh, small children. They will not make any errors in subtracting these kind of problems. And obviously at higher level in competitions you need such methods up your sleeves. So if you like this video, do share it with your friends and do not forget to subscribe the channel for more uploads to come.